Pinpointing the pandemic tonight, a new way to track the coronavirus in your neighborhood. The map showing exactly which Sacramento County spots have the most cases. CBS 13's Marley Ginter is live with how it works. Marley. Well, I'm sure many of you want to know exactly how many COVID-19 cases are near you. Well, just this week, Sacramento County released this map. It's an interactive map that shows you exactly how many cases there are by zip code. I have, uh, I have a blood cancer, so I really can't be catching this. Already fighting an underlying health condition, Craig wants to know exactly where COVID-19 cases are. So we showed him Sacramento County's latest tool. Oh my God, this is wonderful, right? The new county website shows the number of COVID-19 cases by zip code, perhaps the most pinpointed breakdown we've seen so far. It's color-coded, showing the deeper red areas have the most cases. I talked with Sacramento County Public Health Director Peter Bielenson over Zoom. Some parts are more hard hit than others, um, but it's really to reiterate the point that we've got to, we've got to make sure that people to socially distance. Dr. Bielenson says it's part of the county's efforts to be more transparent, and many people we talked with say they'd use it. Because I want to know how many people have it in my area, I wouldn't shop here. Because I look around and people aren't wearing masks, they're not protecting themselves, and the whole idea is that you can be non symptomatic and you can give it to people. But it's still by zip code. Zip codes are very large. You know, zip codes are five or six neighborhoods. So if we can get this broken down by neighborhood, broken down by testing. As for Craig, he uses it, but he wants more specifics. You know, I cannot get this virus. It will probably kill me. Um, the odds are I'm going to get it, but damn it, you know, give us the information, Sacramento County, so we can make up our own decisions. And I actually did bring that up to the county. The public health director says this is actually just the beginning. He says he does want to zero in even more so, but they're looking at ways to do that without violating any HIPAA laws at this point. Yeah, let's hope he's wrong. Let's hope he stays healthy along with everyone else. Marley, thank you.